Welcome back to my channel for a new video and as you all know today is Black Friday so I thought I'd do an exclusive Black Friday collective haul for you guys sharing what's new in my wardrobe. I also feel that November is literally cyber month. The sales start earlier and earlier this year so please don't overspend if you can't afford it. I feel like sometimes we get so like pressurized into this whole week. Cyber week is just crazy and yeah there's deals everywhere so please make sure we are sensible and we're not overspending so yeah let's get into my black friday collective haul so recently i've been shopping for more evening party wear pieces because i feel like my wardrobe does lack evening wear items just because i don't go out very often and i feel like i'm always reaching for those capsule wardrobe staples to build my evening outfits but i feel like sometimes i do just miss that like nice top or that nice new piece when you do have plans especially during the festive season too so the first piece i have to show you are these two satin skirt so both of these are from naked fashion and as you guys know i've been working with them now for the last year and their black friday sale has started today which will give you 40 percent off everything which is already applied at the checkout but you also get 50 percent off in their black items which is exclusive to today's deal so yeah of course all my naked bits that i'll share with you in this video will be linked down below for you in the description box as well as all the sizing so i ordered a new black satin skirt so i do have have one already in my wardrobe but it's more of a cropped shorter length it's one that I tend to style more in the spring season in the summer just because it has more gap at the bottom to show your sandals or whatnot and it is shorter and probably more easy to wear as well but I wanted one which was a touch longer so it looked nicer with my long boots and I've worn my other shorter skirt the gap looks a little bit weird because I am five foot six and the length on this is super flattering so I ordered this one in a size 36 and then I also ordered it in this beautiful chocolate brown colour which has been a huge trend for the autumn season it comes back every single year I thought it'd be nice to add a brown one as well into my wardrobe which is a little bit different from black so yeah both of these in a size 36 and they're definitely true to size. Then next I have this little corset top which is actually a thong bodysuit. So it's super supportive and the fit is incredible. So for the evening, I do like to style like little corset tops with my blazers, wear it with a skirt, some nice tailored trousers, even my faux leather trousers. And I went for this one because I really like the low V. I think it looks a little bit more dressy as well. It looks nice in a blazer, it looks nice without. And yeah, the fit and quality of this is amazing. I wear it in a size small. Then if you follow me over on my Instagram, then you would have seen me sharing these two tops. So I was definitely missing some nice tops in my wardrobe. And both of these are from h &M. You would have seen this one on my last vlog, but I got it in the white color. Absolutely love the fit and the bow detail. Looks so expensive. And then because I love that one so much, and I thought I could wear this in the summertime as well, I ordered it in this beautiful red color, which I'm absolutely obsessed with. I did style this recently as well on my Instagram I'll pop a picture on for you because I felt so good in this top I didn't think that red would really suit me but I feel like yeah I've really enjoying styling that pop of red trend and I think for the festive season as well this looks beautiful and it's a really beautiful deep shade and tone of red and when I wore this to an event last week I got so many compliments on this and it also has like a fitted corset on the inside so the fit is incredible it is a little bit awkward to get into if you are on your own but yeah I'm really glad that I got both colors in the and I wear them in a size eight. Then next I have another really simple, nice top. So this one is also from Naked Fashion. And as you can see, it has a one shoulder detail, but it also goes into this point at the bottom, which looks really expensive, but really simple too. Especially style with some like fur of the trousers, some black trousers. And I did size up in this to a size medium as I wanted the front bit to sort of sit really smoothly and not be too tight so it could hang nicely. But yeah, they do this in other colors as well. Very, very simple. It's a really nice material too. Then next I have another nice top to share with you, which is this knitted one from Pretty Lavish. I think for the evening, it's nice to have some of these little tops in your wardrobe because they're very practical. They keep you warm as well. And you can style them underneath your blazers. I really love the crossover detail on this. It looks super elegant. Got it in a size small and I love it tucked into some trousers. Then next I have another bodysuit. So 
so I feel like this doesn't give it any justice whilst on the hanger but as you can see from the cutaway it's a one shoulder bodysuit which sort of wraps around into this one long sleeve which looks really cool I really like the sort of cut out detail and I feel like for your evening wardrobe you don't have to have loads of nice like fancy tops you can wear something really simple like this with a nice pair of trousers a nice bag and pair of heels even with some jeans I really believe in the nice top and trouser formula for your evening wardrobe and yeah this one is from H&M and I got it in a size small then next I have the famous silver coated trousers so these were a huge hit last festive season I really wanted a pair but I wasn't sure at first but I wanted a pair that wasn't like too in your face and these ones are from H&M I love the fit of them they fit me really great they're only $24.99 as well so such an amazing discount I did actually size up in these to the size 10 when I ordered them I ordered them in the size 8 and the 10 but unfortunately the 8 was on the smaller size so I do recommend sizing up in these trousers they also do them in black too but I really love the silver coated material super easy and comfortable to wear and they look so expensive as well then next I have a classic black blazer so what makes this blazer different from my other ones is that it's more of an evening blazer so as you can see on the cutaway it has just one button here and it's tapered in at the waist so it sort of gives you that sort of peplum effect and I think in the evening time with some skirts with a bodysuit underneath or styled with some trousers it's nice to really like show off your waist and I really liked this fitted detail it also has these pleat details at the side too so it sort of gives you a little bit of something on your hips and I say true to size in these like I always do in my Nike blazers and I got a size 36 then next I have this little black mini dress so this also comes in white too and it's only $18.99 from H&M but I'm actually going to style this like I saw it in the store with some black trousers I really like this sort of like bandu like blazer tailored look they did lots of these like in Zara during the summer which were linen and they look so nice styled with matching trousers so I got this in a size 8 too I did try on at the size 10 in store but it was too big on me but the quality is so good in this for $18.99 I love the buttons down the front and I would like it in the white one but I think it has sold out now then next I have this little crop jacket to share with you so this year I've definitely been a fan of little tweed jackets and I saw this one land on H&M and I really loved the pearl buttons on it especially for the festive season I'm thinking of maybe styling this with maybe a pleated skirt or a satin skirt or even just some nice trousers I just love how these jackets look they just look so simple so elegant I feel like the buttons are sort of giving Chanel vibes as well it has the beautiful rhinestone and pearl detail all over the pockets too really lovely I did size up in this as well to a size medium I have been sizing up in these jackets because I find that I do like to style them done up and for me being a bigger bust girl if I have something that's too small I do button it up I feel like I look a bit restrictive and it's just a little bit too tight here but yeah I got the size medium in this I'm not sure if they do it in any other colors but I really love these little buttons then next I have these two cozy sets you would have seen both of these on my last vlog video they're both from H&M and I love matching knitted sets especially for styling at home and getting all cozy so the first one is this grey one I love the v-neck neckline too I do like to wear a little vest underneath these as well just to add another layer and give it a bit more interest but then because I love the grey so much I had to order it in the cream too I got both of them in a size small then next I have another cable knit piece so I do have this already in the cream colour but I saw it land in this grey one I had to order it I feel like grey is my favourite colour to style in the autumn and winter season this is so cosy as well got it in a size small and it is a oversized fit too then the other day I picked up my first festive jumper so I do have some festive jumpers from the last couple of years I don't really buy many but I saw this one in store at H&M and I thought it was really cute I love the reindeers with the heart I feel like it's a really nice minimal Christmas festive jumper I don't like jumpers that are like too in your face but I know I can sell this going to Christmas markets or whatnot or even being all cozy at home this one is also a bit of an oversized fit too but for me I love oversized jumpers and silk got the size small then next I have this really cozy fleece jacket so I ordered this to go dog walking in and it's just sort of like run errands in I love like a little throw on like fleecy jacket this is also from H&M they did do this last year and it always 
sold out. So I got it in a size small. Again, it is a more of an oversized fit, but for me, I wanted to sort of like layer underneath, wear my t-shirts and just get all like snug and wrapped up. I love things being a little bit more oversized, but they do do this in other colors. I'm not sure if the cream one has sold out now, because like I said, it landed last year and it kept selling it super quickly. So as soon as I saw it drop on the website, I had to order it this year. Then next I have a new short jacket from Naked. So I absolutely loved my gray scarf run from last month. I'll pop a picture style on it because yeah, I love how these scarf jackets look. This is actually a separate scarf and jacket, but the scarf is the same material as a jacket. But with this, I'm not sure if they do do a sort of matching scarf. I'm gonna have a little look because I really love the button detail on this. I love the double buttons. And this one has a more like high collar, but I love how this sort of hangs. And I'm really enjoying styling like shorter style coats. I feel like most of my coats are longer, but I really do like how a shorter one looks. I got this in a size 36, a very true to size. And yeah, this would also be really nice in black too. Then I have another coat, which you would have seen already if you watched my latest vlog video, but I shared this on my Instagram as well. It's from H&M as I really wanted a dark brown coat, which was brown but grey, if that makes sense. I feel like this is a really beautiful tone coat, but like it's definitely in between beige, brown. It's just a really great tone to wear in the autumn season and the winter. And it's a really great price as well. So I did actually size up in this to a size medium, which I am very pleased that I did because I feel like it was more on the smaller size. And I do like to size up in my coats. And just so I've got room for all my layers underneath, especially jumpers before. I always used to buy my coats in like extra small, small, size eight, and I ended up selling them all because I couldn't get my layers on underneath. So now I'm very like conscious of making sure that I do order my coats in the right size. Just they're practical for me to wear and I do prefer more of an oversized look. But yeah, this was a really great price. I'm not sure if they do it in any other colors, but I think a classic coat style like this is just so timeless in your wardrobe. Then next I have a new trench coat to share with you. So this is also from Dish and how beautiful is the tone of this. I feel like it's a very similar colour to my Birkenstock Bostons, hence why I went for it. So I feel like I have trench coats which are lighter. So I have one from Nike which is lighter, which I absolutely love. I also have a linen one from them too. And when I saw this one, I thought, yeah, this tone is super nice, especially style with like grey denim, like darker blue denim. And yeah, of course, because it's from Dish, it's beautiful quality too. So I got this in a size 10, which is the Euro 38. It's a really beautiful for length um, it has this nice yoke detail on the back and for height reference I am five foot six then the last piece of clothing I have is this little short jacket. So this is from a brand called Fourth and Reckless. I feel like it's very, very similar to the, is it Massimo Dutti brand? I can never say it. I'm very bad at literally butchering pronunciations, but I feel like it's a really good alternative to that because it's literally a fraction of the price as well and the material is really nice really amazing quality i'm not sure if you can see but it's sort of like a brushed fur material i can't describe what it's like but it's honestly so soft and i really love the details on the shoulders the big chunky collar too but also this lapel detail it reminds me of my arquette short trench coat which i love so i feel like i am going to experiment more in shorter coat styles like this because yeah, I do have lots of longer coats and I love the dark brown color in this. And I really like these brown black buttons too. Not sure if you can see the detail there. And I got this one in a size 10. So now onto some footwear. So I feel like I've been lacking heels and I wanted some new like sparkly festive shoes. And I spotted these on Nike and I feel like these are literally Cinderella slippers. Like just look at the bow detail on these. They look absolutely stunning. Like honestly, look how sparkly they are and I feel like the heel height is really great too like I always say I am not great in heels and I really love these perspex style ones but as well if any of you are getting married this year or next year but like for a hen party these shoes would be incredible and I say true to size in these and got a size six and majority of my most worn heels are all from Nike fashion because they're literally so comfortable they always do like really good cushioning on the balls of your feet like I said I'm not a heel girl if shoes are uncomfortable for me I won't won't wear them and yeah my most worn heels are literally all from naked fashion then i wanted some new evening like dressier knee-high boots and these ones are real leather from naked fashion and how beautiful are they i love the square toe on the end but also the heel height is great for me and this like patent leather just looks absolutely beautiful especially like with the discount as well whenever i do shop during cyber week i always look for things which have like 
like wool in like real leather shoes i always go for the higher price point pieces because you get more for your money a bigger saving and it's stuff that will last in your wardrobe forever so these are definitely going to be my new evening knee high boots i do have some from them already which are more like a slouchy style boot which have a thicker blocker heel so i wear them in my daytime outfits but yeah these are so nice and the leather's gorgeous too and finally because i'm loving silver at the moment i got some of these silver sling back shoes from h&m again they're not too high for me we do like a nice low heel they're more of like a kitten heel but i love the sling back and the silver pointy toes i'm thinking of styling these with maybe some like gray wide leg jeans and a nice top during the festive season or even like with like my t-shirt my blazer i just love how wide leg jeans look with court shoes like this and a little bit of silver as well just looks super nice potentially match to like a little sparkly bag and my sparkly earrings i also got these in a size 6 too sometimes in sling back sole shoes with like with no strap i do have to size down because i do have quite narrow feet but these were completely fine i just love the silver pointy toe so that is the end of my exclusive Black Friday collective haul. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching and you've liked all the pieces that I've shared with you today. Also, don't forget that Naked's Black Friday offer is exclusive to today, where you get 40% off everything and 50% off in their black items, which is such a good discount off one of my favourite brands. So yeah, if you have enjoyed watching, then please don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you on my next video.